Despite political tensions between the US and China, a recent study suggests scientists from the two countries are collaborating more than ever. I would say we haven't seen a diminishment of research activity between the US and China. In fact, what was interesting in our earliest research is we showed that collaboration between US and China increased in the earliest days. We didn't see any of it stop um, because of political intervention. Caroline Wagner of the John Glenn College of Public Affairs at Ohio State University led a team that analyzed global scientific papers on the virus. One key finding of the study was how China upped its research into the coronavirus after it was first identified in Wuhan in 2019. The first six and most highly impactful articles on the novel coronavirus came straight out of China in the very earliest days. Kind of in contravention to what we hear that China was not cooperating. In compiling the research, Wagner worked with Xiaoxing Chai, a visiting fellow at Ohio State from Zhaojiang University in China. Even before the pandemic, the United States and China are at the forefront of coronavirus research. This study suggests that once COVID-19 was identified, research escalated, driven by smaller teams of scientists in both countries in order to accelerate the pace. Wagner says despite political barriers, top scientists find a way to collaborate. What we see is that really this international network of connections has arisen above the national systems. But above and beyond that, we have the elites that connect with one another um, and produce great science, um, a little bit regardless of who's putting the money in, right? They're looking for that frontier, you know, where is the knowledge base that we need? Scientists hope that knowledge base will soon transfer to a safe and effective vaccine that can then be distributed globally. Dan Williams for CDTN, Columbus, Ohio.